Hello lovelies, it's Miss Lady Lace here and today I have for you the next fabulous edition of my Tea With Me series. This is a fabulous series where I talk about some fabulous discussions and sip tea with all of you. Today's decadent tea is just a classic English breakfast tea and I'm drinking this out of a beautiful tea set that I received as a gift for my wedding from my beautiful friends Blake and Ryan. Today's video will be a little bit different to my usual content. I usually try and discuss an educational topic or share my opinion on something. I really want to be more raw and emotional today and just share how I'm feeling at the moment. This morning I actually posted to social media with something that was a little bit more honest about who I am and I thought it would be nice to make a little bit of a video just talking through this a little bit more. For the longest time I have wanted to be adored. I work really hard and I try really hard for people to like me. In the famous words of Dita Von Tees, in a saying I've shared many times before, you can be the ripest, juiciest peach and there'll be still someone who doesn't like peaches. And it's so true. Not every Everyone will like you and that's alright and that's something I've been working really hard to accept. 2018 has been an incredibly successful year for me. I've made so many achievements but I often find when I do really well I do often attract a lot of negativity my way. When you do well sometimes people will try and pull you down below them so that they can try and seem bigger themselves. I've had quite a few people attempting to bully me in a way and People taking advantage of my kind nature as well. Kindness is something I never want to lose. I think it's such an important part of creating a beautiful community for everyone to feel safe and secure. No matter what the instance is, I think kindness is always the best thing we can do. But with so many bad instances recently, I found myself just being a little bit rougher and more irritated and that's been something I've been really struggling to deal with. There's that famous saying that the longer you hold something, the more weight it tends to carry. Like if I hold this teacup, for five minutes it'll even start to have weight but if I hold it beyond that point the weight really starts to weigh me down and I think with a lot of these instances I've really been holding on to all the things that have been happening and I quite often don't share this because I don't want people to think badly of me because I've said something that isn't completely positive but we all have different experiences and we should have the right to share those just like anyone else I have really good days I also have bad days and at the moment I definitely say I am at a bit of a lower point just in my mood and I know like all things it will pass with time but I just thought it would be important to share that I also experience the same feelings that I know many of you have as well. In this video I'm making a commitment to myself, a commitment that I will be more who I am truly with the world, to not let people put me down, push me around and being more honest with the experiences that I've had and definitely not being afraid to speak my mind. I've been working professionally in the pinup and burlesque world for over eight years and I feel like I've definitely earned my place and the respect of many people around me. I have worked tirelessly in the last few years to create a really beautiful community and vintage events where we can all come together. This is a pledge of honesty to work toward being the best version of myself. I believe wholeheartedly that I'm an unstoppable force and I'm going to dream big and make my wildest dreams come true. I do feel so truly loved at the moment. When I initially posted up this post sharing some of my thoughts, I had an overwhelming downpour of different people expressing their love and affection and support for me. And this isn't something that I expected at all. The post was not in any way to get attention, but just my way of putting out how I feel and holding myself to my commitment and my pledges that I'm making to myself. I'd like to say thank you to all of you for your love and support. It truly does mean the world to me and it really pushes me to work even harder to be an amazing person and give back to all of you. We're all facing our own battles, battles the world may never see. These experiences help us become the people we are, but if we come together, we can be stronger and work through this together. Now I do know this isn't my usual sort of positive, amazing video, sharing something informative or educational, 
but I do hope you've enjoyed it anyway, getting to know me a little bit better and what I'm kind of going through at the moment. I will be following up this video with more stuff on mental health, more honest reviews on events and products I receive, as well as so much more. I feel today has really helped me share who I am and you should never be afraid to be yourself. Thank you so much for listening today. If you'd like to follow my daily pinup adventures, I'll include a little link here as well as at the end of the video. And as always, if you'd like to stay up to date with all my vintage fun and never miss a video, be sure to hit that subscribe button below and I'll be seeing you all real soon.